Hey, Bad Friends Live, and we're at the tail end of our we're tour, at the guys. Tail end. This is and it. We're, and we're, dude, we've got a special show. Yeah. And if you don't go, dude, you're dumb, dude. You're dumb, dumb, dumb dude. Dumb. We're coming up in Washington D.C. Denver, Col then Denver, Denver, Colorado. You got to get tickets now. That's right. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Yep. Chicago, Illinois, my hometown. Minneapolis, Minnesota. Stop Where you're from, Minnesota. Things happened to me there, man. And then the very last date is Madison, Wisconsin. Well, yeah, go check it out, dude. So let me tell you something. DC, you're up next. Then Denver, get ready. Get ready. Baby. We're strolling down the line. Get in. Coming to the Midwest. We love you guys. Go to badfriendspod.com for those tickets. Badfriendspod.com. You can hit my face from there, right? I'll promote okay. tomorrow. If I can spit it, yeah. it can hit your face. You'll promote tomorrow. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'll blow my back out doing this. Ready? Yeah. Please, guys. Oh! Shoulder. Shoulder, dude. Try. Try what? I said, if it just hits my head. Shoulder. I'm not promoting tomorrow. I'm not promoting tomorrow. I'm not gonna promote anything, you fucking fat. There we go, there we go. There we go. There's the hostility. Dude, you don't know how to take a fucking loss, dude. I should just learn from you, dude. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah? I'm the L King, yeah. Great, great musician. Oh, okay. that's, 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 she's great. Okay. You two are bad friends. Who are these two idiots? A white dude and an Asian dude. You two are disgusting. Well, you two are something. We're bad friends. Well, here's the here's the deal about Halloween. Yeah. We're not going to be here this year. And last year. Where were you? I'm going to be, be. Where are we going to be? I won't be here. Where am I going to be? Well, you'll be here, kiddo. <laughs> you'll be here, bud. Oh, then I'm going to be here. Well, but, but wherever you're going to be, there's still going to be Halloween. Yeah, but I won't have to hand out candy this year. I've never handed out candy. I, I turn all the lights off. Well, kids don't go to the... Who's going to the hills to get fucking candy? <laughs> That's great. The Hollywood Hills. But I still turn off the lights. <laughs> for who? Your neighbors? Well, I do it for Jehovah Witness and Halloween. You don't want to talk to some Jay Wits? No, dude. Really? Yeah, I'm always like in the dark like this, seeing them walk by. See, I like I liked to hand out candy. Don't you think it's cute when the kids come through? Yeah, my last place was such a trap house. I didn't want anyone coming up there. You didn't want to give them some, some fentanyl on the way home? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, let, let me. Why, why candy though? Huh? We should switch well, it up. No, it's easier to lure them in with it. <laughs> what, yeah. Yeah. You know, I mean, I, I, what, wouldn't do a dollar be cool? Or do you want a king size? Huh? Oh, Come on I in. See. Wouldn't well, a dollar be cool? Yeah, yeah. There, there were always. That's so funny you say that. There were Asians in my neighborhood that handed out. That's money. right. That's why we did it. You hand out money. Yeah, a dollar. What is that with you guys? We love it. We, money's better than candy. I'll tell you that right now. Because money gets you candy. Dude, for fucking Christmas. Let me say something. Let me say something about Christmas, dude, okay? Mm -hmm. Growing up, when we were six years old, my dad goes, no more. He goes, no more Christmas tree. Because the lat, the, when I was five, they put one up and it stayed in the house all year round. Yeah, decoration. To the point, but to the point where all the pine Needle. fell off. Needles. It, is that what it is? The needles, yeah. Yeah. So it was just branches. <laughs> yeah. Right? Yeah. So all your... And then my my mom would put squid on it. What? You had to dry the squid. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, And like laundry. Well, laundry makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it was like laundry and like dried squid <laughs> on this fucking branch tree. And my dad wanted to go, no more! That's really the nightmare before Christmas. That's what that is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the most impressive thing you ever got? For Christmas? Yeah. I mean, my dad would give me those Visa gift cards, but I was like, like I wish you put some thought into this. Yeah, what is about you guys and thoughts? I don't know. You, you, you white guys. people with your thoughts? Your brother's not white. Yeah, I want feeling with it. Yeah, we do. No, no. Every year, like Kalila, right? I would just go, here's an iPad. <laughs> and she was- well, and she's like, you know, you know, every year I get an iPad. But she's- <laughs> I know, but that's $800. She's mixed, right? Yeah, but there's just still white. The white side was like, the white side was like, I want thoughts. Yeah, it'd be nice to get an iPad and a note. No note. What's the note for? Show some love. Yeah. No, I say it verbally. Do it to me right now. Give me a note. Okay, dear, wait, who are you? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to be you? I'm me all the time. I don't want you to be you. <laughs> Who do you want this? me to be? Be just some, my neighbor, John. I'm John, your neighbor. <laughs> okay, dear John. What a beautiful neighbor you are. Thank <laughs> Are you okay, John? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, you know, it's so, what a joy this time of year to share my holiday greetings with my neighbor, John. Anyway, happy Christmas. I have cancer. <laughs> yeah. And I go, bye. <laughs> oh, here's our iPad. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll I read this in hospice. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, is you guys, about, especially women, 
with their, I want feel, you know, it's like. Yeah, we want some emotional attachment. No, no. Like <laughs> that's more important than the no. gift. Yeah. No. Yes, it is. Oh, so you'd rather have, okay, you'd rather, well, let me say something, all right? You'd rather, the, the you. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm, a lot of white women in the studio today. I, Be I careful. Don't give a fuck. You're that's outnumbered. Why it's getting me crazy. I know. And enough of the pumpkin spice. Well, it's not a good flavor. I agree with you. This is bullshit. Pumpkin's it's not bullshit. a good flavor. It's never been a good flavor. Go fuck yourself. You're pumpkin, never going to stop that. Yeah, and pumpkin stop crocheting. has no business. White people, stop crocheting. No, no, no. That one I'm cool yeah, with. Yeah. And you're badminton. We need bad men. I, we I, love I'm it. I'm tired of your white ways. You don't want to smack a shuttlecock once in a while. What? It's called a shuttlecock. You don't want to <laughs> smack that thing around. Get you don't right. want to smack a cock All in right. the backyard. I'm sorry, but so no more pumpkin spice pumpkin and, spice and, and no more thoughts. No, thoughts are nice. Because <laughs> let me say something. And this year for your birthday, because you did such a great job on my birthday. Thank you. I'm going to have to put some thoughts into it. Yes. Yeah. But I don't want to. That's why it means something. That's why it means something. Yeah, but I you're can... the only one I'm going to give you thoughts. I like that. Yeah, yeah. I like, th I'm, I'm like, I'm, we're going, I'm going to Hawaii with a young lady. Okay. All right. Private jet? No. First class. Spirit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You give her the window seat? Yeah, yeah. Um, West jet. Are you, what, what's you're, that, you're, what's West Jet back, right? <laughs> and you know, you gotta stop by Canada first. Yeah. So you're going to Hawaii with a nice young sweet. What lady. I'm saying is, and you're gonna rebuild houses. <laughs> that's no. We're, too, we're gonna find kids first. What are you gonna do with them? No, I mean, there's some people missing, so we're gonna go to Maui and find. Oh, you're to search for the un. un sure. Oh, that's sweet. That's why we're there. That's nice. But then we're gonna tan too and eat nice food. <laughs> 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 and this is how I tan right here, like this. But anyway, um. That alone, right, is a thoughtful thing that Taking I'm Taking someone to Maui. I yeah, agree. If, if, like when I take you to dinner and I pay for it, right? Yeah. Do I pay for it? You always do. I always do, right? Yeah. That's thoughtful. It I is. love those. But I don't have to say it and I don't have to put any thought into it. Right. Yeah. But, you know, the gesture is nice. It's I do every day, I do generous gestures of love. Give me a GG of love right now. What did you do today? What's a generous gesture of love that you did today? To you? In general, that you did today. <laughs> what did you do today? You said you do them every day. What, what's today? Oh, I, 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 know, I know. Okay. Today's Tuesday. You got your nails done. That's not it, though. You got your hands shortened. Did they no, no, no. I mean, no. I got no. I got my nails done. Oh, <laughs> right, right. I don't know if they're shrunk. So I go to a place, you know, with a bunch of. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Yeah. Beverly Hills Housewives. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> They've got work done. Yeah. Right, and they're always they're always like. It, we, we, we. <laughs> <laughs> They're always like, oh, welcome, Baba, Baku. <laughs> right? Right? Yeah. Story, right? <laughs> and I give the $100 tip, hands and foot. What? Separate. $100 a piece? Yeah. That's insane. That's, it. but. That's generous. Is that thoughts? That, no. That's just. Yeah, it, but is that thoughts? That's rich guy shit. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah. still, dude, I'm telling you right now. I'm going to, all right. I'm, I'm going to call somebody out right now. I'm going to call somebody out right now, dude. Uh -oh. All right? Okay. Well, I'm not going to say his name, but you can guess. Okay. He's a, he wrote a bunch of spiritual books, very popular spiritual. L. Ron Hubbard. Somebody, <laughs> someone like that. All right? And I, so I used to work at a restaurant way, way back. We know. Okay. Yeah. And the spiritual guy used to come in there uh -huh. and he wouldn't tip that well. And we knew that he had money. Oh, we talked Ram about Das. Yeah. He's, what? Ram Das or whatever his name is. Not Ram Das. What are you fucking talking about? Ram Das would tip. What, yeah, yeah. What, Jesus, Ram Das, he would all tip. What's going on with you? Yeah, yeah. Ram Das. Was that a joke or is that an honest guess? No, I thought it would because he's by San Diego sometimes. So I really thought. When's the last time you jerked off? Uh, you look. You feel like you're built up. Days ago. No, I'm not. I hooked up with a girl last night. Come. She had a shirt that said, "I." Look Did you come? Yes, I came. Okay. All right. We'll get to that in a second. Uh, yeah, yeah. Give yeah. me back to the famous guy who tip didn't tip. Four days, by the way. Huh? Four days. For you? Yeah. Someone's holding out. I'm holding out. That thing is going to... I know. It's, <laughs> it's so days. hard. And the last night was the toughest one. I know. Last night was... Pumping up that balloon. It's going to pop I was everywhere. playing Starfield, right? You were just coming during Starfield? <laughs> no, no, no. I was... No, well, yeah. <laughs> so exciting, the game. Now, I'm playing Starfield, and I'm on a planet, and I'm like, you know, at a uh, weapons installation. Got it. But let me finish. Yeah. <laughs> right? There's too many details. Just tell I, me and, what and, happened. You know, yeah, and also, like, the Crimson Fleet's there. 
So I'm going around, right, with my fucking gun. I got a new gun that I, you know what I mean, upgraded and stuff mm -hmm. in my house in uh, um, oh, Aquila City. I, I have a house in Aquila City. Oh, okay. cool. <laughs> Let me finish. Uh, <laughs> right. And so I'm like, you know, snipe, 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 snipe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but my dick is like, snipe, snipe too. Oh. See what I'm saying? Got it. Do you understand? You're ready to snipe. Right. And I'm like, hello, Toki. You know, what's my penis? Isn't Toki Dum Dum. The Dum Dum. The Dum Dum. Sorry. <laughs> dum. Apologize. What the fuck, dude? I know. I know. Yeah. <laughs> Don't want to offend the guy. Toki the Dum Dum, <laughs> right, was up. <laughs> ready to go. Right? Man, this story is like your sex life. Like, is he ever going to finish? <laughs> <laughs> That's a zinger, dude. Thank you. That's a zinger, dude. I like it. Montreal next year. <laughs> oh, this Montreal guy. next year. Dude. Only New faces. Anyway, um. <laughs> uh oh. We'll be right back. I take back what I said. I'm sorry. <laughs> Did you do that? I hope not. When you give him a good zinger, that's like when you <laughs> poke a, poke one of those voodoo dolls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll never choke again. So anyway, anyway, I'm fine. This guy didn't tip very well down in rich guys. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Well, no, I pinched the head of my dick. Let me finish last night. Mm. <laughs> so I, I like how these two things are kind of. <laughs> I, I, well, it's like a, yeah. I'm like a Tarantino movie, dude. You really are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So um, I pinched the head of my dick to, and he went. Mm, yeah, when you, you're right. Choked him out. But then he went back to sleep. Right. I did like a well you tapped him out I did a rear naked <laughs> choke dude. I did a rear naked choke to my dick dude. you tapped out your dick I tapped out my dick dude Whoa. and he's like tap 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 tap, tap right right Dana but there White's was no ref to call. yeah there's no ref no that's it he did let yeah, it so I didn't let him pass out wow yeah you know because my fingers are like you know black belt in jiu jitsu <laughs> Tick. so I, yeah, I pinched him out he fell anyway back to the spiritual guy Got he me. didn't tip that well every time and I know a lot of guys that don't so th th for you to you know when I went to the <laughs> right. nail, nail salon yeah so don't do that don't not tip no I'm just saying don't say that because, because I have a little bit of money and I tip that was still generous on first my of all a hundred dollars is more than generous that's yeah. rich guy shit twenty dollars a person would have been generous uh, can I tell you why I do that though because you only have hundreds no well that's true <laughs> yeah that's true. Yeah. Let me look at my. There is no. There's no small <laughs> bills. Me, That's me, the problem. Let me look. Same thing. We were what? We were valeting somewhere. I said, yeah. "Do you have any money?" I said, "Just give me a couple bucks. A hundred dollar bill." It's like I can't give that to the valet. That's ins why would it, that's that's too much money. You would have done that though. Look, hundred, hundred, hundreds, hundreds. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're all hundreds. Right. So that's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, but do you know why though? Get smaller bills. No, but guess why? Do you know why? Because you get paid in hundreds. From where? Shows. Yeah. Yeah, I know. So it's not. But go to a thing and break. You're it. right. You're right. You're right. What was I saying? Give that money to the girls. No, I don't want to. <laughs> Give it to the girls. They have enough money. Look at them. They do not. Yeah, look at them. They do not. They're she told spice, me before the show. They're pumpkin spice girls. Are they pumpkin spice girls? Yeah. The look pumpkin at them. spice girls. They're the look at them. They're crochet. They crochet. Well, one of them knits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess which one knits? They probably have an ottoman. Do you have an ottoman? What do you mean? I have an ottoman at the house. Gay. Yeah. <laughs> gay. <Just> the... <laughs> Who's gay here? Right. Well, it's easier to blow and, my boyfriend I, I, when my knees are on the ottoman. <laughs> I don't want to go on the ground. It's I also hard. bet. You, I bet you money, you girls, right? Have nooks. Yeah, they have a nook, a reading nook, a reading nook, a breakfast right? nook, and you probably have candles that smell nice, <laughs> right? That I Ooh, don't. I love. Candles. I refuse. I no love thoughts candles. and no candles. These, these are all great. And you probably have a barrel of rice somewhere. I mean, yeah, we <laughs> yeah, all have of our thing. I have a, we all have our thing. Okay. <laughs> all right. All right. Anyway, you don't have good smelling candles in the house. I actually do. Yeah, you I have, do. I, have, I just bought some. Uh, <laughs> I bought a gigantic Santel one. I love those. What's it's that? a gigantic Santel thirty three from La, La, you know the La Labo. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I got a gigantic. It was so expensive. Give me what <laughs> six, seven hundred dollars. Thousand, oh, thousand. I don't want to talk about it now because of the. Tell me how much. <laughs> Tell me how much. The big. Well, candles. I bought two candles and a gigantic one, and then two sprays. I spent about 400 bucks, maybe. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, I, yeah. I mean, it's a lot of money, but I thought it was, for some reason in my mind, I thought that was going to be one of those. Oh, so just uh, FYI, I don't really have a lot of money. Okay, let's throw out that. Okay. Yeah, okay, let's move on. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, by the way, yeah. I thought when Oliver was here, he was going to get you to put down the vape. What? He did make it seem like he was going to get you to stop vaping. Well, this, whose fault is this? Guess in the room whose fault was Jules. Wait, who, whose fault is the- Why I'm smoking jewels again. Carlos. Thank you. Well, I mean, I know. Thank you. You but fucked you, me up again. Well, you know, you fucked me up. How did I fuck you up? Okay, I'll tell you this. Okay, you tell me everything. You gave me a hundred milligram edible. It got me- Whoa, 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 whoa. 
a couple years ago. Yeah, I'm sober it, now, it, almost two years. Yeah, no. It lifted me into another level of weed use, and I've never gone back. So he forced you to eat it? Well, he offered it to me, and you know, <laughs> I didn't want to deny it. Well, so yeah, I put really you at another level of consciousness. Yeah, I like it. But yeah, I'm good. Saying, like you've also, and you're probably it. dreaming better. <laughs> that night, I did dream really well. Th you're welcome. And then he employed you and pays your and bills. And I employ, <laughs> yeah. employ you and pay your bills and, yeah. and, and whatnot yeah. and such. Thank you for everything. Did you get your car fixed? You know, he got his car keyed. Oh shit! The first the fucking week, one? this guy's got a car. It gets keyed. Yeah. This guy. You got it fixed. No, I'm no, not. you're never gonna get fixed. Okay. That's like, what I said. Like my, you know, I my know. car. That's what I said. Well, you're never gonna get that fixed. I'm never gonna get that fixed. Everybody at the comedy store, there's a running bet on if you're, <laughs> if you're gonna. Are you really? Yeah. Richie over there is like, just let me fix it for you. Yeah. Let no, he I wants. Me, yeah, he wants. He wants to fix it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I wish we could just show a photo to the fans of your car. It's, <laughs> it's, so it's hysterical. You know when you see a car, people at home. You know when you see a car that's in one of those junkyards and it gets smushed <laughs> from one of those machines. His is like if they did it to the sides, they yeah. smashed the sides <laughs> okay. and they picked it up and moved it. Well, I know it's not your fault, but it's hysterical. It's been that way for what six months? A year. Yeah. I just okay. I mean, I just don't know what to do. Well, do you want me to do it for you? Because I I know you. You gave me a guy. Then I had my guy call the guy. We yeah. made an appointment. They go, okay, come at three o'clock or whatever, whatever, right? Yeah. I just never showed up. Well, that's <laughs> fucking what the fuck. <laughs> so, by the way, my I guess guy you have to show up. That's my guy's so good. He'll fix it for. I mean, it's. I know the guy. We contacted that guy. He's that awesome. guy was like, he's yeah. And when we go on tour the next time, this time- We're getting it fixed. We're getting it fixed. I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, tell us about your little expedition the other night. Oh, I and, went on a date with this girl. Yeah. And she shows up wearing a tank top that says, I love cum. Stop. At a, if she, in public? Yeah, in Echo, uh, Echo Park. Lake. Oh man, I get back in my car and go home. No, she's hot. <laughs> Why? She's Italian. That means she- You're gonna walk around with a girl that has a shirt on that says, I love cum? Let me say something, okay? To be fair- If I'm a smoothie- Huh? If I'm a smoothie- You're not. I, <laughs> I know, but let's suppose I was a smoothie hypothetically. I see it now. You see it right. And I'm like, you know, a banana smoothie. Oh, uh, yeah. Right? And um chocolate lovers? And is, and, is cocoa and I want someone to drink me, right? I'm going to drink it. And I'm on I'm on Hinge. Uh-huh. I match with a girl. Oh, I thought you said unhinged. Right? So I True. You know what I mean? They don't have leg smoothies. No. Right? But I, you know, I mean, I get to the house, I knock on, right? And the door opens and she goes, I love smoothies. Or I drink smoothies or whatever. Mm -hmm. I would be excited. That's what I'm saying. Right. But in this scenario, yeah. it's too real. You have cum inside you. Yeah. She likes the cum. Right. You like it when the cum is being retrieved from your body. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah, I do. You don't like it when it's released from your body. No, but it's more fun when I don't really know how much she loves it. Yeah. Yeah, but what if she didn't like it at all? Let me give you a better example. Okay, go ahead. All right. <laughs> Sorry, that was when a bad I, example. When I go to my family's, no, it's a great example. When I go to my family's house, yeah. right? Like my extended family. Yeah. And they cook a dish that I like. Yeah. That's a fun surprise. Uh -huh. I don't need to know the whole time that the dish is on its way. I uh, like to be surprised. Right. I like to get through. But what if they bring out poo? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> See, that's what I'm saying. Oh, you're thinking they might flip it on you. Yeah, they might flip it on you, right? So. <laughs> what, it'd be cooler, well, what's, what's your favorite dish? Of all time? No, the dish that you're at home and you, you you know, it's a surprise or whatever. Uh, lasagna. Oh, great. Love right? lasagna. So you're sitting there, right? You smell lasagna, <laughs> right? You're at the dinner table, right? Mm. They light the candles, you know. What are the candles for? Oh, they the smell, smell good in the room? Yeah. He, oh, the whole house yeah, smells yeah, like yeah, lasagna. Yeah. What are you yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah. And there's like <laughs> the flavor of the candles, pumpkin spicy. No, I don't like the- Oh, I, whatever. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm blowing them out. And you're like, you're, you're looking at the nook and you know, you're like, what book am I going to read? And you, I'm going to put my feet up on that ottoman, right? Look what she knitted. Right. And then in your head, right? And you're like, I smell those onions coming, right? And then they bring out poo. <laughs> so what I'm saying is, is that- Wait a minute. If your aunt had lasagnas coming on her shirt- you had some weird dates, Bobby. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is it poo or is it cake? <laughs> That's a good show. <laughs> is it poo or is it cake? <laughs> I, 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 I think, I don't think my, I don't think it could, you got it, what I was I saying. Th yeah. No one else on planet Earth understood what I was saying. But I, you know what? Imagine That's what if I you had you. to eat it first. <laughs> yeah, is it poo or is it cake? <laughs> you're not allowed to cut it, you said yeah. to eat oh, it. Oh, right. <laughs> I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. Okay, good. Let's hear the rest of this bullshit go ahead, insane go date. Oh, sorry. A girl who wrote, I love cum on her shirt, well, which by the way, it's not sold. That's, you know, I can't scoop that up at American Eagle. That's a custom shirt she had made. Well, yeah, she told me. She went down to the Santa Monica Pier <laughs> for the same guy that does like caricatures and he's like, you want a shirt? Yeah. What do you want it to say? 
Yeah, she liked it. It said, I love calm and it, it did get me a little excited. But then to be fair, you do forget about it after a while. Did you forget you, that she's wearing a shirt that says, I love cum? Yeah, because she has a jacket and like it just says, I love C for a second. So you could kind of forget about the whole thing. Yeah, I wouldn't forget Oh, oh so the C is in the middle of the shirt? Yeah, it's a C-U-M. No, the cum goes up to the No, it's vertical. No, it's it's C-U-M. Oh, it's a, oh, okay, 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 okay. So what I also want to know is where did you take this human on a date? Oh, so we went on a walk with uh, Archie, my dog, at a yeah. park. Oh my god! And then, <laughs> not to a restaurant or a facility or no, bar. That was, that was her fucking idea. I'm normally not the oh, let's go on a walk guy. Like that's crazy. That's but, not crazy. I think that's a nice date. So I never do that. I'm just like meet me at a bar, a restaurant. No, no, no. Take a walk. Okay. Yeah. So we go to a bar. I can't bring my dog in. So I go. Why don't we just go to my place? Oh, trick uh, little trickery. A little trick, trick, trick. trickery. No, trickery. no, it's a little trickery. That's yeah, wizardry yeah, at hand. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, she invited me to her place. So I was like, no, we'll go to my place. I knew my place would be nicer. That's Expellius Seminus. You <laughs> you did a little fucking <laughs> trickery on her right Harry there. Harry Potter, dude. Thank you, dude. Expellius Seminus, yeah. dude. Yeah. Expellius Seminus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Here's the problem. Now you're going to employ this in the future because you know you can take the dog out and go, we can't bring the dog in here. Oh, a million percent. Right. So it just taught him a new move. Yeah. Now he's going to take the dog on all the dates and go, you guys don't take dogs here? And they're like, no. Is it a service dog? And he's like, well, yeah. And they're like, I'm sorry we don't. He's wow. like, this is embarrassing. Yeah. And this is my best friend. You're not going to let me and my best friend and <laughs> this new girl I'm dating. I mean, this is a fucking move, dude. I know. Hell yeah. This is a huge move for you. Yeah. So you guys went right back to your place and that's it. What that's if she says, uh, what if she says, we'll just drop the dog off and then we'll go. No, no, no. We, I was like, let's just go to my place. She was all in. No, he's the- asking you a question, an alternative. This he's calling an yeah, audible. Alternative. What's the question? If she says, drop the dog at the house, I want to go back to the bar. Mm, that's a lot of driving to go all the way home. Okay, good, good, good. I, I'm, I'm just, I'm just trying to be diligent. I got to tell you, you're, 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 if you say that to her, you're kind of oh, cutting yourself out. <laughs> Keep no, in no. mind, she loves. Let me. I, 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 oh <laughs> yeah, yeah, she that's loves. Right. Oh, okay, let me. Okay, you're in the place now. Yeah. Because I have certain moves. Okay. Well, don't give them away on the show. I, I'm never going to say my moves. I hear you. Right? <laughs> no, I'm going to write a book one day. Yeah. You know what I mean? Bobby's you'll, moves. Yeah, you'll write Yeah, you'll write a book. Are you going to love it? Yeah. You know, yeah. You'll write a book. Vroom! Vroom, vroom. Vroom, 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 vroom. You vroom, guys, vroom, vroom. Vroom is the only way. The only way. You should buy a motor vehicle. I got my mom a car for Christmas. It was the first time she ever got a brand new car, and using Vroom was the easiest thing on earth. A Vroom is the better way to buy and sell used cars. Looking for your next ride, go to Vroom.com now to shop thousands of cars right from your phone. You never have to haggle or negotiate the price of the car, so you know you're getting a good deal, guys. And best of all, when you buy a car on Vroom, they deliver it straight to you, right uh-huh. to your front door. You have a full week. You have one full week or 250 miles, whichever one comes first, to make sure the new ride is right for you. No more driving around and getting appraisals. Ugh. You aren't sure for, uh, that are the fair value. No more posting online or dealing with buyers and their endless questions and haggling over the price. Not with Vroom. Not with Vroom. When you sell your car to Vroom, you get an instant offer in as little as two minutes, right? You yeah. Don't, you don't need to sell it if you don't want to. You can just buy one from them. All you need to get started is your license plate or VIN. Just answer a few questions to get it moving with Vroom. If you decide to sell your car on Vroom, they'll come pick it up free of charge, sell your car to Vroom or trade it in. If you find something you like on Vroom.com, Vroom, it's the better way to buy so and just, sell used cars. So just head over to Vroom.com now to see what your current ride is worth and check out thousands of cars to find your next one. That's Vroom.com. 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 Sheath. Let's take a quick second and thank our newest favorite sponsor for today's show, which is Sheath Underwear. Mm-hmm. Sheath makes the most comfortable boxer briefs I've ever worn. Yeah. If, you've ever sick, if you're ever sick of boxers that are too loose or briefs that are too tight, Sheath is for you. And I'm going to say something right, okay? Give it to me. I have tiny, delicious, very nice testicles. Tiny little blueberries. I have little, little blueberries, right? Blueberries. But still, it needs room. Yeah. Right? And sheath underwear, I have, uh, that's all I wear, yep. right? It has that room. Yeah. And my testes, dude, are free. They're chilling. They're treat. They're they're chilling. They're chilling like they're, yeah. They're chilling like they're a just treat. hanging out. Yeah, dude. Like you and I. Bobby's wearing sheaths now. He wears them all the time. Yeah. They are the most comfortable boxer briefs you're ever going to put on your body. It's unbelievable. They have a little space for your uh, conquistador, right? Yeah, and yeah. his two friends. And uh, sheath is particularly useful for staying cool during the summer and while working out. Uh, the most unique thing about sheath underwear is that they have these uh, dual pouches that keep your man parts separated, all right? Prevents mm-hmm. things from sticking together, keeps them right where they need to be because we all know you chafe, you scratch, they get stuck to your leg, you, uh, your conquistador gets in a little fight and he bends all one way. You don't have to worry about that with sheath, okay? 
So if you want to keep your friends in good condition, get some sheath. How do they get them, Bob? <laughs> Go to sheathunderwear.com and get the most comfortable underwear you'll ever wear. If you go to if you use the promo code bad friends, you're also going to get 20% off your order. That's sheathunderwear.com, promo code bad friends for 20% off your order. They also have new bamboo pairs and a new women's collection that are perfect for all weather conditions. Sheathunderwear.com. What do you what do you do? Do you go The movie is sitting outside on my deck. What? I like, we like chill outside on the deck, smoke weed, have some- Oh, you smoke weed, do drugs? It's not drugs. I'm not giving her fentanyl. I know, I know, but still weed is a drug. Well, then they're not going to be sober. I, I, yeah, no, no. All right, so you smoke weed, you giggle, <laughs> do you tell a joke? Yeah, we talk about things. We go. Oh, you probably Google like um, dwarf skeletons. No, that's only. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's a good one. No, I can't do Give that. us a topic on a date that you bring up in a conversation. Yeah, you're the girl. Yeah. Yes, I am. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, this is a nice deck. Oh, thanks. I just moved in here. Cool. Yeah. What do you pay for rent here? Uh, Like 3500 That sounds right. Yeah. <laughs> do you want to smoke a joint? Um, I'm going to light one. Okay, cool. That's cool. Do you want some? No, I'm okay. You, it's pretty good. I'd rather have cum. <laughs> right this way. <laughs> okay. Wow. I guess that worked. Yeah. Wow. Did she keep the I love cum shirt on while you guys were hooking up? No. no. That would have been funny. Yeah, it would have been, but no. She took You're taking each other's clothes off? She's what if she, what no, if she no, no. smoked the cum? Jesus. She said, I'd rather cum, right? Jesus. I smoke it. <laughs> I did go to a girl's place, yeah. and out of nowhere, she lights heroin on a spoon. She start, It starts bubbling like Pulp Fiction. Out of nowhere? Let me tell you something. <laughs> I bet you it wasn't out of nowhere. You're right. It was it's an insane. escort. It was Hollywood. Yeah, yeah. An escort in Hollywood. It was an escort? Oh no regular Joe Schmo <laughs> is just lighting up H on a spoon like, whoa, I, where did that come from? I bet you the circumstances led themselves to know this person's going to do heroin. Can I say yeah. something? I was, on, like, I was at the Korean spa at two in the morning the other night. And it was on, so I was on Western and- Wilshire. Six. Like in that area, right? Yeah. And then, you know, there's a, a string of prostitutes out there. And I had, a, I, I stopped and I had my window rolled down <laughs> and I see a prostitute and she looks and I, I went, hi. She said hi? I did. Why? I don't know why. <laughs> you, were, you were playing with fire. You wanted- No, I, I didn't know what to do. So I go, hi. And she's like, she did something with her friends like, move on. Cop, 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 <laughs> cop. Right away. Really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You'd feel like a cop. I'd be like, that's a cop. Hi. And I rolled up. I was like, why'd you say I like that? I've, I've never been propositioned. I had, a, I had a girl look at my car, then like look at me, and then go, and then look the other way. I've never even had a- You look like a cop then too. Do I, I look like a cop, yeah. 100%. Yeah. I rolled down my window once in Hollywood and just stopped where they all are. Yeah. And I had my door unlocked. Yeah. And I just wanted to see what would happen. Waiting for one to get in? Yeah. And one did get in, but it was cop. not a woman. What? It was a man dressed like a woman. And I went, oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. He was I mean, also wearing an I love cum shirt, yeah. by the way. <laughs> Same guy. <laughs> but I was really lucky he, she got out of the car. They got out of the car. They, they. Teach I, yourself the right shit. I have, All right, pal? I have a story to tell. Yeah, please. So one time, I, I got to say some, this guy's name. So there's a comic name. Do you remember oh, yeah. him? Yeah, I remember that guy. Right. So one night he was like, after a show, we're at the store. And he's like, let's go down to Santa Monica. I go, well, is there a restaurant there? I'm, it's like one in the morning. There's stuff to eat down there. I know. Yeah. And I go, where is it? No, no, no. Let's get, you know, prostitute. Oh. I go, but they're all guys down there. He's like, dude, you're not going to know the difference. Ooh. You might. <laughs> He's right. Wait, wait. Dude, really? You're not going to know the difference. Well, some of them are really hot. I've seen some really hot trans. I mean, I would know the difference. I think I would know the I difference. Think I, I think know. I would know the difference. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I don't know the difference. No, no. <laughs> No, we Wait, don't. sometimes you don't know the difference? What? You don't see the Adam's apple? I don't look there. I'm not looking at your throat when I meet oh, you. Oh, you don't look at the throat. That's the I key. Never look, look at, the, at throat. the throat. Don't look at the throat. That makes sense. It's more just like- Hands? You don't look at the hands either. No, and that's what happened. So the guy who okay. got in the car, that it was like a black guy, huge hands. I was just like, dude, this is not a- You got to be careful letting people into your world like this. I know. It Did was, you see this cop that hooked up in the backseat of his cruiser? Yeah. Did you see this? No. They have it on video. It's like, what the fuck are you doing? He's like hooking up with this chick and then they get in the backseat of his cop car in like broad daylight. It wasn't no. even like trying to be discreet. You saw this, fans? It's crazy. No. But then apparently he says, it was in the news. Apparently he said that it was consensual and they had done this before. He stopped someone. And they but it looked like, yeah. it obviously was. looked like he was being bad boy, bad boy. What you going to do? Mm -hmm. What you going to do when they come for you? Those are good lyrics. You should write a song. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs>
That's really cool. Bad boy, bad boy. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? It's like that's essentially like a, like a lyrical, you know, like a vibe. Yeah, man. All right. uh, what is it? Say it. Again. Bad boy, bad, bad boy, bad boy, bad boy. What you gonna do? Oh, this is great. Britney Spears dancing with knives. Let's take a look at this real fast. <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. Hey, I, can I, I, I can I, I tell I you? Her. I already made a joke about this a long time She's ago. Good spinning on this show. We were all like free Britney, free Brit Britney, and I said on this show, "Are you sure?" Remember? Oh, Are saying, you sure? You're saying she's too free. Are you sure you want her free? Yeah, she's a little too free, right? People are like she doesn't need a conservatorship. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, you're right. Are you sure? You're right. She's wielding kitchen knife. Look at her dogs in the background. One of those things is going to end up at a restaurant. <laughs> look, look at the way she's waving around those knives. It's show, play the video again. It's bonkers I feel I love this girl I feel bad there's no way this is chill started playing with knives today why Brit don't worry they're not real knives Halloween is soon yes they are those what, are knives what, what, it, what, what would it be like hooking up with her you think I like that I, she's I, pretending I, those are not real knives those are definitely real so knives real. they are real there's for sure real those knives are definitely not fake, says the internet. <laughs> what would it be like to hook up with her? Is that what you're saying? Well, just the a to date know, her? No, the, no, just the after hookup talk. You know, you have that talk. The chat. Yeah, the chat. You're, you're called, naked. Yeah. You know, you get the towel. I'm a towel guy. So you stay naked the whole time? I do. After you hook up, do you put on any kind of clothing? It's most it's most times. Yeah. You put on something. Yeah. Not yeah. me. Not me. I put on a costume. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah. Like, I'm, I used to do that. Yeah. I used to do that. I used to do the Robin. <laughs> you know I mean? Yeah, I'll just put on, I'll put on a yeah, costume. Yeah. I'll put on Iron Man mask. Just the yeah, yeah. butt naked Iron Man mask. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like you and Britney Spears would be perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that I think about it. But what, I mean, what was she talk about, do you think? I imagine. You just her legs over you. You're, you're, you're sweating. She feels you're like, like, oh, that was great. She might sing to you. Ooh. I know. <laughs> Ooh. A new song, though. Oh, Not even Bobby, a bad Bobby. <laughs> oh, Bobby, Bobby. <laughs> how was I supposed <laughs> to know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then you probably do a dance, too, right? Hit me, Bobby, one more time, time, time. You're like, I got to go. <laughs> I have to leave. My yeah. car's here. Wait, you haven't seen my knife dance. Come see my knife dance. <laughs> Ooh, you're going to love it. Yeah, yeah. In my living room, I, I wave knives and I TikTok. Ugh. By the way, I called it on the show a long time ago. If this leads to something crazy like they put her back, they 5150 her, I should have made a bet on the on our fans because people were like- What's 5150? That means it's the for oh, yeah. for uh, mental health. Uh, what is it called? What's the, the cops come and take you and take me to the mental? Fifty one fifty is when you are mentally unstable. That's when you. Um, mm. What is it called? Uh, allows a person with a mental challenge to be involuntarily detained for seventy two hour psychiatric hospitalization. So you can fifty one fifty someone to be like, I'm worried they're going to hurt themselves or hurt someone around them. Yeah, like we uh, could fifty one fifty you. Please don't. You could fifty one fifty me. Yeah, I would never do that though. I of know, all the people saying, in here that we would fifty one fifty. Let me guess. <laughs> one, two, three. Carlos. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Wait, you think I'm like losing my mind? No, I no. just think you're a threat to society. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like I feel like you could cause physical harm to society. I do. Some... When I leave the house, I definitely like I know. I want you inside more than outside. But you know what though? Can I be honest with you? Uh, He's the only one I really trust here. hundred percent. I agree. He knows that. And he like knows, you, you he knows he, that. I, I, you would fucking, if I called you mm -hmm. and I go, you got to help me buy this body. <laughs> oh, it'd be so fun. See, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> she would do. See that? You need a 5150 in your life. You need one fifty one fifty. You want, need one fifty one fifty 5150 in your life. Get one fifty one fifty around. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I honestly, this is a, tr like, let's say I relapsed. Mm-hmm. Already excited. Well, see, I'm nervous. I see this makes me mad. Yeah, because the party well, together. Thinking, <laughs> yeah, party no, no. party dude's not gonna help you. He's on, gonna honestly, if I relapse and I called you, I'm like, dude, check it out. I I want some old school a sheet of acid. Do you know where to go? My my closet. Oh shit! <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, and would you bring it over? Um. Be honest. Honestly, I would call Andrew. <sighs> It's about love, dude. Thank you. That's fucking bullshit. No, it's dude. not, dude. No, that's huge. No, that is I, such I, a that's big leap. He's 50, though, dude. He's changed, dude. He's 51, 49 now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, all right. 
All no, right. You know what? I'm what? so glad you said that because I was about to fucking get really. And then, and, okay, so then you call him. Mm -hmm. Then you know what happens. I'm coming to get your ass. And do, what are you going to do? If I decide I'm going to relapse, I'm going to relapse. No, you're not. Not around we me. Can help it. Not around fucking me, you're not. I'm, I'm sorry, I'll in Mexico. Then Andrew runs to have dinner. Okay, I don't know what the <laughs> fuck you just said, dude. Let me tell you, what did you just yeah, say? Yeah, what did you say? Slow it down. I said, unless you're in Mexico, then Andrew runs to have dinner with some friends and Bobby gets <sighs> dropped in my lap. Yeah, put him. I put him in your lap. Well, well no, he already I, I, showed I, I, up I, fucked up in Mexico. You were already fucked up. When did wait, you were babysitting me in Mexico? Yeah, you got fucked up at dinner. You don't remember this? Oh, yeah. You, you, I, I remember you tried to order me like a, a Sprite. <laughs> he tried to start a fight with me because I ordered him a, a, a mocktail. Yeah, he's so you're so stupid that day. I'm stupid? Yeah, because you, I'm like, I'm going to get what you're getting, and you come back with a mocktail. You have alcohol. No, I don't. I didn't have alcohol in mine. Nobody had. Nobody had alcohol, you fuckhead. But you were pissed off because there was no booze in it. You were mad. You were throwing a big fit. And then you went. I'm an got, alcoholic. I know, dude. We were trying to stop you. And then you went and got fucking booze anyway. And you pooped all know, over the room. Where there's a will, there's a way. There, I know. It's unfortunate. So if I'm going to call him, he doesn't pull through. I will call somebody. Yeah, but uh, but at least when he calls me, I'll be over at your house to fucking get in your way to make it more annoying for you to use. But would you. I mean, I'd, would, I'd get in your. I'd roadblock you. For I know. I know. But that would be a nightmare if I relapse, huh? Oh, yeah. I would not be happy about it. No. No. Let's yeah. not. Let's not do it. What are you going to do about it? I would cry. You would cry? Yeah, because I've never met you in that state, and but I've heard all these stories, and mm. I feel really lucky. Like when we, I, you came into my life, and you're like on this good track up, and it would be kind of devastating to see that. Thoughts. See. Those, and then I'd the, fifty one fifty you. <laughs> <laughs> That's thoughts. That's thoughts. That's pure thoughts. Dude. That's pumpkin spice yeah. right there. Yeah, the pumpkin in the spice flesh. Right there. In the flesh, dude. <laughs> You know what, dude? I'm grabbing totating toward it. Good. I'm going to get that next time at Starbucks. Let's get it. Let's oh all my get God, it together. Really? Yeah, pumpkin. Let's all get it. In fact, you know what? Order pumpkin spice right now. Right I'm being real. Yes. Get it delivered here. McCone. McCone. Go, go get, get me some, some pumpkin, pumpkin spice, spice, dude. I'm, I'm a changed man, dude. I want a cold. Do you girls want pumpkin spices? Yeah, get, get pumpkin them. spice for everybody, too. dude. You know what I mean? Carlos, give him the card. Carlos. But I want also an ice version. I have money here. Come here. Pumpkin. No, just come here. He'll give him cash. Come here. Give me get cash. Get cash here. McCone, will you give me a cold? Is this enough? Is this enough? Enough? Pumpkin cold foam. No, give him two hundred just in yeah, case. Really? Thank you. I think Bobby will want that too. He wants an ice. I don't think. I don't think it costs two hundred. It does. It does. It does. They do now. They're expensive pumpkin uh, spice. Yeah. Okay. It's a really limited spice. Yeah, limited. <laughs> it is. He's gonna yeah, text McCone. Oh, okay. Thank Coney. You know, Starbucks is right down the street. Yep. Great. Yeah, yeah. So get me, but I want mine iced. Whatever you get me, and get, add two shots to it of espresso. He'll text you. Okay, good. And you get these girls. They want stuff too. Ask them what they want, McCone. Yeah, exactly. tell Carlos. All right. Are you getting hot or cold? We are. The pumpkin spice yeah. uh, Okay. Uh, let's keep. Let's get back to where we are. <laughs> this you, is you. so exciting. I know. Yeah, yeah. But now you're. Anyway, thanks for the thoughts, and I'm leaning toward pumpkin now. I like this a lot. It's pretty good. You're changing me, dude. It's great. See? Yeah, I love it. Power of thought. I, you know, ottomans and nooks. I don't know yet, but no, you'll get to. Trust me. By you, the end of the episode, ottoman. <laughs> <laughs> you think so? Ottoman, you'll be there. Yeah. Nook is a tougher it's one a tougher to get one. you on. Yeah. But ottoman. Oh, Shay. Never gonna happen. Never gonna happen. Uh, you yeah, know, yeah. one of the flight attendants on the flight back was was knitting something. Yeah, and uh, it reminded me of how I used to get knit stuff from family members. So lucky, and uh, how much it means to me when you get that. That's that's why the whites do that stuff because you get a knit thing from somebody and you go, I don't even. It doesn't even matter if I don't love it. It's so wonderful somebody made it. And then, guess what? It goes under the bed in a rubber a Tupperware. I know, yeah. <laughs> no. You don't ever see it again. You I never get, see it again. Well, it's like a lot of gifts. There's yeah. a lot of things I get, you don't see it again. But at the moment, it matters. It's nice that they made a thing. Like some, some one guy gave me a skateboard with my face on it. Yeah, that was so dope. No, that was one we made. Oh, oh. But oh. he actually took a board and just drew art on it. And I go, that's cool. And you'll, right. That's good thoughts. Well, how about this? The toys that I got you, those custom toys, where did you put those in your house? I'm like, uh, right in my living room, you'll see right, 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 right where everything is. That makes me feel really good. But that was a that was the real good thought. thoughts. Good thoughts. Sometimes the thoughts aren't good. Well, give me an example when thoughts aren't good. What's the worst present I've ever gotten? Uh, well, you, you you mentioned any kind of card. Yeah. Yeah. Of anything. Of a, at all. Because I don't even know what it is. Hmm. They'll go here. Here's Clim Climpendales. Climpendales. <laughs> The I restaurant, Clippendale? No, I'm just, yeah, I'm just making it. Clippendale. Clippendale. Yeah, Clippendale. Yeah, I've been there. Right? And you're like, yeah. what is this? Oh, it's you can get yarn. 
Oh, right. Right? And you're like, oh, thank you. Well. And it goes in a drawer. I get it. And then 10 years later, like, well, Clemondale car. You know what I mean? What are we going to do with it? Yeah. Um. So I don't like that. I don't like shit like socks or tie. Yeah, any of that. Like, well. What? Who's giving you socks? My brother used to give me spa socks well, that, every fucking that's year. That's because he's, you know. I know. I yeah, know. they love socks. Yeah. But they put them on their hands and their feet. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> what? They put them on their hands and their feet. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this. The reason I got that image in my head is because a guy that's helping out around our house right now. He had, I, I think he was trying to like, <laughs> he didn't have glo- maybe one glove was missing. He had a sock on his hand, <laughs> and I was like, to "Who did we hire?" <laughs> He had a full blown sock. Well, he one hand had a glove, the other one had a sock. I think maybe it was for. I, it was. I don't know. I so I went, Did he put, put holes through the fingers, or it was just a sock? It was like a mitt. <laughs> it was gloves. Wow. It was a glove and a. It mitt. had the color stripes at the bottom. It, it was yeah. It was, <laughs> it's like old school gym sock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, because we're getting our yard dug up in the pipes. Or can you help me with something though? Mm-hmm. I need somebody. I don't know where to go. I googled it. I just need somebody to put wallpaper up in my house. Oh, I got the guy. I have the guy. And then also wood paneling and stuff like that. Yeah, I have the guy. Who? I'll give it to you. I'll give you a But he's a good guy? He, unbelievable. I don't want to give too much of a story away because it's not my business, but he was at one point someone of a, a name that people know. It's going to blow your mind off the air. And he, he could help me? Yeah. He literally fixed it. He builds houses. He used to be somebody you know. Like an architect, like James. No, no, no. He was an Frank, actor. Frank Lloyd Wright. He was an right. actor. He was an actor that was- successful. Oh, so it's an actor that I would, if he came over- when he, he was go, young, shit, you're when good he in was smissions. Young, you would be. <laughs> <laughs> when he was young, he was an actor. Smissions part two, dude. You were so good at that. that, that smish- small wonder? Yeah. Yeah, small wonder. Yeah. So it's we, somebody I know. You will. Re- you might recognize the name, yeah. Really? And he fixes stuff. Can you do this and just tell me? No, I'll tell you off the air. Okay. I got the guy. You do? I 100%. And he's great. Okay. And he's meticulous and he's slow and sweet and he listens to um, jazz while he does it. <sighs> He puts a little jazz music on. What's wrong with that? I actually really enjoyed it. I don't have to be there though, right? <laughs> of course not. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. DoorDash. Oh man, we love DoorDash, DoorDash. so much. DoorDash. Bobby uses DoorDash literally every, every day, time three he times eats a day. food. Let me see something right up. This is my DoorDash. Don't show them. Don't I'm not going to show them. Look at all the things I get. Oh my God. It's, it's my endless. favorite thing. It says load more and I'm not going to do it. And but my point is, is that when you're on the road or you're at home, wherever you are in the country, if you want groceries, yep. you want del- delicate food. Yep. You want elegant food. Yep. You want something fast like a you, taco taco. Yep. Yep. Right? You go to DoorDash. You got to go to DoorDash, ladies yeah, yeah. and gentlemen. You've trusted DoorDash to deliver your restaurant favorites, and now you can get grocery delivery that actually delivers too. That's the best part. With thousands of grocery stores to choose from, you'll find the best in your neighborhood and boost your local economy with each and every order. You get exactly what you ordered. They're going to make it right. Cat litter. Uh, easy substitutions. Right. If they don't have the cat litter you want, they're going to get you something else. Yeah, yeah. Okay. DoorDash knows exactly what's going on. If you miss something, they got your back. Bleach. Whether it's food or bleach for something that you got to clean up. What did you do? <laughs> what did you yeah, do? Yeah. Whether a you're tarp, ordering food a tarp. for your house, a tarp, <laughs> bleach, a shovel, yeah, yeah, a rope. Yeah. Maybe you're doing an outdoor backyard project. That's right. Whatever you want, they got it. Uh, so here's the deal. Get 50% off your first DoorDash order up to a $20 value when you use the code BFMART at checkout. Limited time offer terms apply. That's 50% off up to a $20 value on your first order through DoorDash when you enter code BFMART. For 50% off your first order up to $20 when you try try DoorDash. Don't forget that's BFMART for 50% off your first order up to $20 when try. you try DoorDash. Try. Get some DoorDash. Try it. That's I don't like say. jazz. It's like, you know, like they, that goes crazy. I like... Burr, 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 burr. See, that sounds like jazz that going crazy. That doesn't sound like good jazz. What? That's no, that's like, you know, I like... It. You like... No, that's too fast. Too fast. It's smoky. You it's smoky. I know what you don't like. Where it's like. Yeah, and I'm walking in. I have my suit on. Yeah, yeah. And I, I, I lean with my cane. I pull out a cigar, <laughs> yeah. right? I do a little jiggy. I do a little... Right? And then I fall over, <laughs> and then I die. Right. Yeah. But I like slow jazz. Slow jazz. Yeah. Or oh, I like the, you know, what's the, the what your people do? Like, a, not a bossa nova, but like. Oh, yeah. Uh, the like, impi- what's, the, what's the kind of music? The impanina mini. 
Uh, empanin, uh, 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 empanada. No, no. Flamenco? Flamenco. No. Girl from Emp Empanadas. Girl from Empe uh, Empanadas. That's I like that. I'm walking through an airport. In the 1960s. Yeah, that's how, that's how, yeah, that's good. What, what kind of music is that? You would know, that's your people. Brazilian. Like a yeah. Brazilian, yeah, oh, that's yeah. not your people. It's not at all. Yeah, yeah. yeah, my bad. I when you it. would like one of us, the social club. I love yes. that. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cuba. Very good. Yeah. Still not his people, by the way. But it's, it's adjacent. Can we learn to do capoeira? That's one of my favorite things. Is that, is that the spinning martial arts? Yeah, can we learn to do I that? I already know how to do it, dude. Get <laughs> fucked. Teach us. Do it right now. Can you get oh, up and do... I can do capoeira. 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 Was this a capoeira? Yeah, show me some capoeira. Yeah, man. I need an opponent. <laughs> yeah, Carlos is going. Carlos, well, yeah, yeah, Carlos, Carlos is your opponent. I'm here. Okay. Don't All right. Well, you better film it, fans. Right, so Hold on. I need some space. Wait, 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 wait. All right, go ahead. No, no, no. Let's see. Right. What's the couple way to music? <laughs> Hi. Whoa! You lost. You fucking lost, dude. Whatever, whatever that was, you lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? That was dope. Just, That's it, dude. Dude, you lost. That you lost. Yeah, dude. that ended so fast. <laughs> yeah, it ended fast, dude. Don't you know how how dance battles take place? Yeah, dude. Once you get embarrassed, it's over. It's over, dude. dude I'm seeing stars. I'm right just now. gonna say you're about to pass out. I'm about to pass out. Dude. I'm seeing stars right now. That was crazy, dude. Sugar Because when, when I put my my, uh, 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 I don't even know what to say. The weight on your arm. arm Dude, yeah. it started trembling. I started seeing stars. And I'm like, this is a bad idea. <laughs> hurt. My stomach hurts a little. He got me. I, that's what it is, dude. I know. That's couple, yeah. Yeah. And I'm uh, gonna tell you, dude, I never even took a class. <laughs> get out of town. Never. You never took one class. No way. I think that honestly, I think that some people are born knowing the secrets of the martial arts. <laughs> You think you've got it in you. I think I'm instinctually, I instinctually know all forms of martial arts simultaneously going within my body. Holy shit. And my spirit, dude. Wow. <gasps> oh my God. Oh. Careful with those. Ow, ow. You, do you understand? Ow. That's what I'm saying. How did you hit me yeah. from over there? Yeah, and I don't even need to take a class, dude. No, you don't. I know how to bow. I love bow. That stuff's so dude, good. I... <laughs> Pork, yeah? The, well, they're poor veggie. Red bean. Red bean. Red bean, red, red bean, bean, red bean. Uh, no, no, yeah, the, that's sticky buns. I like those. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. That's red bean, red paste. Yeah. No, not bow the fucking pastry. What else? Bow. Yeah, I will. Yeah, I'll eat it. I'll have it. <laughs> no, what, <laughs> no, like before. Like, you don't even know what I'm saying? What are you talking about? Bow, the dumpling. No, 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 no. Bow. The actual gesture. Yeah, like thank you for the bow. <laughs> what is the gesture? <laughs> Go, come here, Carlos. Oh, boom, 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 I did hot yoga for the first time. <gasps> oh, shit. Ooh. It was really Whoa. fun. How hot was it? It was like 98 degrees or hotter. No, it's got to be hotter than that. Yeah, 100. Is that a boy no, band? 30. 98 degrees or hotter? <laughs> yeah. No, isn't, isn't there a boy band like 98 degrees or something? Yes. Yeah, 90 degrees. Nick Lachey. Okay. One of my boys, dude. Cool. One of my top dogs. How hot is hot yoga? It was so hot. I couldn't believe it. I was thinking about you, Bobby, though, if you were there and I've... I just was think you'd fart a lot in that class. Between 90 and 108. I was, if you fucking, you go to one of those things, I'm calling an ambulance on the way there. No, I'm good in, do, do, You've done hot yoga? No, dude, you guys don't even understand my body, dude. I don't know if you understand you your body. I do, you guys don't even comprehend what the temperatures my body can take, dude. I'm gonna, you know what? Yeah. You're gonna come over to the house and get in the ice bath and let's see what you do. Oh, let me tell you something. You an ice bath? Yeah, we got a nice time. I'm gonna now. tell you something right now, okay? At the Korean spa that I keep inviting you to, yeah, their ice th plunge, yeah, is illegal. Yeah, because like polar bears, yeah, because it hasn't, been, hasn't been cleaned in fucking forty <laughs> All right, years. It's dirty. You're right. It's gross. It's dirty, but not it's... getting in. <laughs> I, let me tell you something about the Korean spa. Do you do? Do fucking racist? Dude. Yes, I am. I've said that on this show for years. 
I'm not going in a fucking spa with thousands of yous that go there. Don't be one of me, dude. Fuck you, dude. Yous. You, dude. you guys in there. Dude, dude. Don't. Dude, don't. Dude. Don't. Don't, dude. Don't, dude. You don't. Yeah. Let me tell you something. Okay. You want me to go to a Korean spa? I know they don't sanitize that fucking place. That's so un... True. Yes. It's untrue. Yeah. You've never gotten anything. You've never gotten a toenail fungus from there or a athlete's foot because I know you have. You fucking told me personally. Uh, Go ahead and say it. I don't know where I got it. Yeah, fuck off. Uh, <laughs> where else? Anywhere. I literally don't know. I Could it be it, the place where people oh, are I'm nude sorry. and sweating all over each other? Okay, how about this, dude? Give it. Athlete's foot. Athletes get it, right? No, 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 no. That's do just they not get it? And, 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 and they get it by running. No, they don't. Yeah, they do, dude. No, they get it from get sharing it from showers. In their fucking shoes. From sharing showers. That's what that's from. From from dirty feet, to yeah. bacterial infections in public places. Anyway, you guys don't know about my body and my temperature. Oh, how much it Well, then let's go to hot yoga together. I'm down. I'll do it. My body can take all kinds. It was so fun. But did A Pompeo? You, I would have survived it. Did you tell the story about the... <laughs> Pompeii? Or Ellen Pompeo. <laughs> Are you talking about Ellen Pompeo, the actress? No, I'm talking about the politician. <laughs> okay, okay. Is there, is there a politician named Pompeo? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking about him, dude. What about what about it? Go ahead, babe. Did you tell this story about the shuttle bus at the airport? No. What well, happened? Don't tell that story. Okay. No, tell it. We might have... To, I don't know how interesting it was, but it was the f hardest I've laughed in so long. What All right, okay, so... <laughs> But we get off of there. Where was it? What city was it? Oh, God, I don't even Cleveland. Know. You guys were out without oh, yeah. me. All right, so we're at an airport, <laughs> and we take a shuttle, mm -hmm. you and I. Yeah, we're the last two. On the, the last road. two. And it's a packed shuttle. Packed. And, you know, it's one of those shuttles. It's all, you, you, you girls will love it. It's very all-American. <laughs> the shuttle they love? <laughs> no, but the people that are in it, it's like oh, kids yeah. wearing baseball. Very they get, just got back from a tournament. Families, old women, grandmothers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hey. What, they have just like an apple pie with them or something? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. And a baseball. The baseball was inside the apple pie? Yeah, American dude. Yeah, American yeah. flag waving. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And it's like, Someone and just... quiet and people are... And we have and to I, stand because... And I'm wearing, I'm listening to music. Yeah. But I go, I go, uh-oh. It's a common. <laughs> you know how your mind does that? Mm -hmm. Right? And I, I don't know how, so I have my music playing. So I bent over a little bit. No, you walked to me okay. and bent over t onto me. Onto her. And I ripped one so loud. So oh, loud. Right? That the whole bus heard it. Yeah. Right? The all-American bus. Yeah. It was so quiet. And people were like, you're like, right? But one father, an old white gentleman, along with her, tears in his eyes laughing so hard. <laughs> he was laughing so hard. The lady behind you, you didn't see her, she was laughing too. Oh, she was? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, It was that loud. It was like... <laughs> and then the, right after the bus driver goes, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for the shuttle? <laughs> so like no one could react to it. Yeah, no one could really react to it. Did but he it hear was, it? The bus driver didn't hear it? Everyone heard The, the, the fucking bus the trembled. Bus yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It was like that, but, but good. You would have laughed so hard. And then he. It was so quiet in there. And then he walked, like, then we're on the bus. It's like two minutes into the ride, and he walks over to me and goes, Was that loud? I have my headphones in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just a little. And she was laughing so hard. <laughs> really, yeah. Dude, we had some, what a moment. You know, you and I have moments, huh? On yeah, the road. We got some moments. We some good, good moments. I'm know. glad I missed that one. It was. <laughs> Oh, that's one why, that I'm, why? I'm happy why? I missed because I was in Chicago with my family not yeah, yeah, getting farted but that was a good bike. yeah because you, know, really you know I would have been like Bob <laughs> like yeah. a dad I yeah, yeah. upset but guess what mm. did it smell it did there okay <laughs> my bad my bad my bad <laughs> my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. Like I apologize funnier. to anyone on the bus side. you thought you were going to cruise right over that <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah you shot it right down yeah, yeah, yeah. it did <laughs> It made it oh, so fuck. much yeah. funnier than yeah, yeah, yeah. it felt because it's like floating. Yeah. You know, I, I'm, I'm, you know, I miss our little meals at the airport. We're I going, know. We're going back out. I know, but just thinking about the, you know, tour, the little meals you and I, remember that little wine bar restaurant that we sat at? Yeah, that was yeah. really nice. That was really nice. Are you at the store tonight? I have one show tonight, yes. Let's get dinner before. I'm at the store. Let's get dinner from here to the store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What time do you going up? Ten thirty. I'm at ten thirty. Oh really? You're not in the same. Oh, yeah, we're room. not in the same room. Don't worry. How long have you? Been? What room are you in? The belly room. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. The small one. The tiny one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she yeah. is small. She's a small. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But that, but that change is coming soon. I know it. The yeah. shift is coming. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's hand out the coffee real fast. Let's hand, let's get some coffee in here, Maconi Boney. 
Ooh. Ooh. Thank Ooh. you. Ah. ah. Did Jesse get one? Is it pumpkin? Ooh. Oh, Cheers. Cheers to pumpkin. Dude, yes. I'm telling you right now, very good. You like it? <laughs> oh, man. Dude. I'm in, dude. I'm white. You're I white. Guess. I'm in, dude. <laughs> You're white. I'm white now, dude. One of us. One, One of us. us. Yeah, One yeah. Of well, I think mine's vanilla. <laughs> oh. I wasn't sure if I should say something, but it's kind of funny because we were talking about the pumpkin. You're all wait, wait. vanilla. <laughs> Why'd you get her vanilla? I just followed what Carlos did. It says vanilla cold I, foam. I didn't write vanilla. I said cold brew with cold foam. It's okay. It's Fine. okay. It's just funny because all of it was Here, baby. her pump. No, Here. no, 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 no. no. Honestly, because I'm not going to have it. It's a waste. Please do it. Why? Because you can't. You're not going to be able to sleep tonight. I'm allergic to pumpkin. <laughs> oh, I should have mentioned. Oh, oh, this felt oh, like a bad idea. Oh, 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 Why did I do this to myself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine I just turned into a pumpkin. Uh, what did we learn today? I learned. I actually. Learned I learned about thoughts. And you learned it's important. You might be white. I might be white. Will you do me a favor, Carlos? Will you get on like Wayfair and buy him an ottoman right now and ship it to his house? I just want to see how you feel about an ottoman once we put it in your house. I've never had one, but I don't know what to do with it. I bet you do have one and yeah, you just don't yeah, know what it is. Yeah, you have a couch, right? Yeah. Do you have another piece of the couch where your feet go on? Yeah. That's an ottoman. <laughs> you have an ottoman. Yeah. You're that's all. White. Oh, that's what an ottoman is? <laughs> yeah. Oh. You're white, dude. Oh. I thought it was more like an ottoman empire kind of thing. I'm about to blow your mind. <laughs> <laughs> what, what? I'm about to blow your mind. Go ahead. You have a little, I mean, I've been to your house. You have a, di a formal dining room, right? There's a place to eat, sure, right? Sure. There's also a little part off your kitchen that's not really a dining area, but it's just kind of like a little place to like, you could snack, right? Yeah. That's a nook, that buddy. <laughs> Dude, you're so white. You're the fucking whitest friend I have. You're so fucking white. But I never go in there. It's a Twinkie. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, oh okay. okay. I... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god dude that's a layered joke that's so good holy fuck <laughs> give him credit dude what the fuck did you call me dude you are the twinkie of this show holy shit that's so good I, and explain twinkie for the v viewers that doesn't know and i'm a reese's peanut butter cup <laughs> yeah 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 so so yeah you, are. yeah you are i really am yeah so tell me what a twinkie is my friend yeah, what do to you the mean? audience? What do you what mean, do you by, mean by that, buddy? It's like yellow on the outside, but white on the inside. Interesting. 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 Because I grew up during the suburbs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, dude, Twinkie is pretty good. Yeah, that's Twinkie is a good. very good thing. And uh, also, can I say something? Then, what do you call somebody that's just full on just yellow? <laughs> what about you? What do you call it? <laughs> Well, what is full Wait. yellow? I, 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 the reason why I ask, I don't know. I can tell you. Tell me. I call you behind your back sometimes. What do you call me? Lemon head. <laughs> Whoa, That's that. full yellow. <laughs> That's full yellow all the way through. Dude, yeah, like, you're right, dude. Lemon head. Yeah. Or a lemon. No, lemon no. head. Okay. <laughs> Something about the lemon heads. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, bring up an image I'm of a, lemon head, the guy, you know, the guy in the box. How is that not you? Aww. That's my little, you're my little lemon head. Dude, I'm a fucking lemon head, dude. When people- And I'm not, you know, dude, <laughs> let me say something to you. I'm not mad at that, dude. I know. Yeah, yeah. It's sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're my little lemon head. When yeah. they say, when people come to the studio and they go, what goes on in here? I say, me and my little lemon head, dude, are showing from here. Yeah. This is me and my lemon head. It's great, dude. I don't I, like the, do you like that candy though? No, it's not candy. I think it's a trick. <laughs> <laughs> I think they fucking put yeah, it out just to yeah, fuck with you. Yeah. No one ever likes lemon. There's no chance someone gets a box of. Look at that guy. Remember that guy from the commercials? Ugh. Whoa. Do him as a guy. Look at him. Look at that. Yeah, look. Do you not remember these commercials? No, I don't. Dude, that's were, a horror show. Dude. Go that's to so YouTube. Fucking scary, go to YouTube. Dude. Bring up a lemon head. This was insane. They ran these for a short amount of time. Yeah, yeah. They were nightmare inducing. Dude, that. Okay. This is one of the candies, by the way, that was handed out sometimes. Mm. If you see someone at the movie theater getting a box of lemon heads, yeah. leave. I'm not watching the movie with that guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a sicko. Yeah, and what's a juju? Whoa. Oh, you can't say that, man. It was just Yom Kippur, but. <laughs> B. Ah. Juju B. Juju B. Oh. Yeah, Juju B. Uh, what is a Juju B? Yeah, because I, I had it. There's no flavor. It's just chewy. They're gross. Yeah, I mean, it's Juju B. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Juju Good? B. 
Is Juju be good? No, they're not. Ew, it doesn't even look. No, it's, it's, not a, it's no, it's that. Oh, it's, it's the, the colorful box. ones. Yeah. Oh, I was just gonna say I did get a really good candy recently, and it's what? these little tiny gummies with mini nerds sprinkled. Oh, on. those are so good. They're so good. It's nerds wrapped around like a gummy squishy in the inside. So the outside is a ball of nerds, and yeah. the inside is a squishy thing. So good. I know. All the door guys at the mother are eating them. Nerds gummy clusters. They're so good. Whoa, dude! I gotta get one of those, dude. Top shit. Those are top. Shit. So they combine two things into one. Mm. Yeah. Let's mm-hmm. do that right now with a different candy. You got it. Go. Yeah, here we go. We take, um, you know, I know what, candy corn. I'm already out. <laughs> yeah, it's like the worst. One. It's the worst candy ever made. And you put it with circus yeah. peanuts? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, circus peanuts. You're like, what if we wrap jujubes with Tic Tacs? It's like, <laughs> well, no. Yeah. Uh, all right. By the way, Tic Tacs, breath mint white, the orange one's candy. Yeah. What was that? Breath mints were the white ones. They said the other ones were breath mints, but the orange ones were just candy. Yeah. I never used it. That wasn't a mint. That was candy. Yeah, that's true. What are the but, two things you'll wrap? Okay, I got one. Okay. You know the Chinese. Think, speaking of Chinese, mm. that invisible... That invisible... Communism? <laughs> what are you talking about? That invisible cloak Nothing over society? Nothing sweeter than communism. <laughs> <laughs> no, man. I, Wait, what? I, let me get it out. All dude. right. All right. It's that wrap that melts in your mouth. It's an invisible. Oh, the Listerine strip. <laughs> They're like Listerine. Strip. <laughs> <laughs> More breath mint candy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, it's an invisible. You've never seen this before. The candy with the fucking <laughs> invisible. No. I thought you were talking about the. Sheet it's like a clear with the dots on it. It's no, like a... there's a piece of candy, a Chinese candy, and the on the outside of it is like it's like a. How do we explain it? I think you were scam. No, it's a clear. <laughs> fuck you, man. It's a clear like wrap, and it, it melts in your mouth. How much do you pay for the invisible candy? What does it taste like? <laughs> <laughs> Give me another hundred. I have some here. <laughs> invisible Chinese wrap ca- paper candy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There invisible we go. Invisible Chinese wrap paper candy. Paper candy. <laughs> Yeah, what does it taste like? What does it taste like, bud? Oh, is that a 50 sheets of transparent edible glue? That's that. No, (laughs) that's rice paper. That's rice paper. Are you eating rice paper? (laughs) (laughs) They use that for baking. I swear to fuck God, man. That? No. That's gelatin. It's a candy with... um, (laughs) Put this out. Honestly, right? Chinese? Uh Yeah. Candy? Yeah. With... um, It melts in your mouth. Like, like, there's a piece of... A, it's a... A layer... A layer... It's like a sheet? Like a sheet wrapped around a candy that melts in your mouth before the candy. What's the candy inside? Oh, like a gobstopper? <laughs> no, those are everlasting. There we go. Oh, right, 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 right. Oh, no. That, that? That! White rabbit? Cream. White rabbit, dude. I never had that. Buddy. Yeah. What in the fuck is this? <laughs> White rabbit cream? Yeah, dude. <laughs> Is that the cream. code name of the girl that came over to Carlos's house? <laughs> cream candy? Yeah, it's a cream and there's a yeah, see see the outside, it's a paper. And you just eat that? You eat it and the paper melts in your mouth first. See that paper? Yeah. And then you get to the fucking rabbit. You know cup. what happened. Oh, what? <laughs> these poor little Chinese. <laughs> yeah, these poor little Chinese kids, they just don't know how to they just forgot to unwrap it and then the company was like, Yeah, eat it. Fine. Fuck it. Whatever. <laughs> Order a bag of that for us, please. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna love it. I want to have a bag yeah, of that yeah. for the studio. I mean, it does. It looks just like taffy. Yeah, is yeah, that it's, what it it's is? It's delicious, though. It's like creamy and it's very light. Now, do we like taffy? Do you like taffy? Saltwater taffy? I never. You know, at, when I go to that's my, a white. When I go to fairs, I don't eat it. What do you eat at the fair then? You gotta get taffy. I get anything that's fair. fried, like a like a you know deep fried Oreos, deep fried something something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Deep fried Oreos are unbelievable. But we got so many great snacks at that Cracker Barrel. Also fudge. You yeah. guys love fudge. No 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 no. Not all the whites. I'm not a big fudgy guy. Me either. What's no. up with like big blocks of fudge? Nah, some whites Fuck like you. that. Yeah, some whites like that. Yeah that's yeah yeah. Me. Are you that the type of whites? Okay. She's, a, she's a little bit of a fudge girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You got a little, a little fudge. She'll pack a little bit of fudge in, but not much. But here's, a, but can I say what you guys do? <laughs> what are the whites is do? Is a true delight, and thank you so much. <laughs> Caramel apples. Mm. Uh, I don't like them. Wrong. They hurt wrong. my teeth. You're wrong. That's no. where you lost all your teeth. <laughs> Okay. Oh, don't make fun of my dental fucking. I think it's so. Funny. You know what's gonna make you feel better about that? What? Bring up Johnny Depp's teeth. 
It just went viral the other day. I mean, look at this guy. This looks like my fence. It looks like my fence in my front yard. Zoom in on that. Oh, shit. Look at that. No, that's the picture right next to it. That's the one right there. No, the Esquire one, bud. That's one. That's his teeth after the, that they just got a photo of him. Now, look, I'm not being mean, but yes, I am. What's going on? Are you eating mud? That's so rude. Maybe dude. he did that for Pirates of the Caribbean. That's exactly what he did. You know what this That's was? called method acting. He was shooting Is It Poop? He was shooting an episode <laughs> of Is It Poop? It does look like meth was involved. Yeah. <laughs> that was I mean, does he... <laughs> I mean, he's a millionaire, This right? was Bud Pirates of the Caribbean. He was eating so much ass. Yeah, he's a multi-multi-millionaire. <laughs> Bud Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> He was on the high seas. Do, 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 do. Oh, wait, I forget this. Okay, can you I do mean, a different? Give me, go, give me to do a, like, okay, let's go to the pirates. One. Those are prosthetics. So those are fake. Look, look, look at that. Those are fake. Those teeth. are nice. Though. Those are fake teeth. That's but not like, his real teeth. Those look better than his real teeth. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's interesting. No, it's not interesting. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah. And what do you, is he? But, but ladies, even though he has fucked up teeth, you'd still hook? Not after the Amber Heard trial, they wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. What are you no. talking about? No, really, honestly, if Johnny Depp asks you out on a date, Johnny Depp, are you single? Are you, are you, single? Are you single? No. Okay, fuck it. If you, you are single, you are. You're single, right? Well, let's get a poll of all three. If you were single and Johnny Depp asked you on a date, what, would you go out? No. What would you go out? No. That's a no from her real fast. This one's pausing. Not Austin. Why not? Like, just, Why not? She just wants the experience, right? She's a, she wants the experience. Yeah, it's but like that's how it starts. <laughs> huh. yep. Then a couple months later, you're pooping in his bed to get back at him. <laughs> <laughs> throwing a glass at your face yeah. in the living room. I wonder if there's a <laughs> woman out there that's beautiful that has controversy like Johnny Depp that I wouldn't date. Uh, Ellen? <laughs> well, there's a couple reasons that that, that wouldn't yeah, happen. That wouldn't... <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah. forgot about controversial, that. A controversial public figure? Mm. Roseanne. <laughs> yeah, Roseanne. Would you date Roseanne? <laughs> if you, you know, I, I mean, I have a thing for her. She actually looks really... I love her. I love her. Amanda I Knox. Her. Would you date Amanda Knox? She just did our show in Seattle. You know that, right? Yeah, would you date her if you were single? She's a nice woman. You, we have to name a controversial woman that you would go on a date with. Who's yeah. got some... Con who's controversial Hollywood female starlets? Now, Amber Heard? Amber Heard, right. The easiest one. There no, you but go. She, but, uh, because, I, because of the trail, I just know things about... I just wouldn't get along. Oh, I know. Amanda Bynes. Oh, yeah. I, I, but I know Amanda, so no, I don't want to do it. You guys are so famous, we can't play this game. <laughs> <laughs> no, I knew her because... What about Kim Kardashian? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no thanks. Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't go out with her? I already have. We dated a couple years ago. <laughs> you did? Right after Ray J. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. What about Caitlyn Jenner? She's got some controversy. She killed somebody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> would I, I mean, do it? I, you know, I would do it for the optics. Oh, because it's good publicly? Or what about, um, what's what's the one? Maybe um, like Caitlyn Jenner and her purse uh, show up to one of the... <laughs> <laughs> Imagine how small you'd be next to her. She's like 6'4", six, 6'5", six, fucking... One of the greatest Olympians of all time. Six, oh, you're saying that I would look like a purse? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I just mean like she brought like, like a... Like, like a, a little bag? You Like a mobile fetish she brought. She put like a string on you and carry around. I couldn't be like her like Maddox? I don't think so. You might be her ottoman. Adopted kid, no? Mm -mm. Bag? Bag. It's You're sucks. a little purse. No, then. I don't know. I can't. There's no controversial There's woman. There's no controversial woman. Courtney Love. What's controversial about her? She killed Kurt Cobain. Jesus. Oh, my um, God. Mo what McCain. What the fuck? Ma McCain? Maco is it John, John McCain? John McCain? <laughs> Dude, his new nickname is McCain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100% yeah. McCain. Here we go. <laughs> All right. Lindsay Lohan. Yeah, hundred percent. Hundred percent. I wouldn't even think twice. Yeah, yeah, I would go out with her. Britney Spears, hundred yeah, percent. Bring the knives. Yeah, bring the knives. <laughs> Madonna. Madonna. One hundred percent. Dude, Madonna. Change yeah. accents while we're talking. Nicki Minaj. Uh, wouldn't you, Nicki Minaj is not controversial. She's the shit. Yeah, yeah. What did she do? Uh, Kim Kardashian. You says that Roseanne Barr. How? I, 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 what yeah. about Hilaria Baldwin, who's from America but says she's from Fancy? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, all those girls all the way across it. Anne Hathaway, fuck it. What did she do? Yeah, what'd she yeah, do? what did she People do? I just don't like her. No, I don't give a fuck. Internet. She's also. Oh, oh, can I just say about her? Great actress. Yeah, yeah no shit. So good. No shit. Great actress. Dude. Who's Kangana Rangat? Who is that? Who's this? Renau. Uh, uh, oh, she's a Bollywood star. Yeah. No? <laughs> so, yeah. She's Bollywood a star. Yeah. Now that would be a land. What? Marrying a Bollywood star? Yeah. Do you know how successful those people are over there? 
it would blow your mind. They're rich. The richest. They're they're like I know they kill. Our movie stars are bullshit compared know, to these people. It. But can I say something? Yeah. They only want light skinned Indians to make it. Well, look at how light skinned you are. Yeah, I'm not Indian. You could be. What? <laughs> <laughs> You didn't know that? No, I'm not. I mean, who have I? <laughs> You're right. I am. I am. I am. I am Indian. Yeah. Because even in certain of these countries, they, they prefer lighter skinned of their people. It's the same thing in your countries. We're just light skinned. No, but Japanese There's like no that. There's no dark. Well, yeah, that's, but, why they, that's why Japanese carry around umbrellas and stuff for the sun. They don't want to get any pigmentation in their skin. Yeah, but why is that a thing in in the world that like that's... Well, it's racist. It's racist, but it's also like even... It's class. It's a, Yeah, it's a form of class, it's right? It's a class system because if you worked outside, your skin was darker. Right. This goes back... This is... This is this is as old as time. So if you were a a, a light-skinned Spaniard, right, it meant that you were wealthy enough to not have to work outside. Right. That's all it was. And then if you're... And then if you're a guy that, you know, fucks hookers on Hollywood Boulevard, you're Carlos. Yeah, you're Mexican. Yeah, but it's not Hollywood Boulevard. Santa Monica. Thank you. Sorry. Oh, look, he's mad at you today. Did you see that? I know. I'm not mad at him. You're you're in a little bit of a nook, uh, nook yourself right now. You're in a little eating nook. Well, it's because he kicked me earlier. Are you still in pain from this? You knew it was going to happen when you yeah. challenged him. No, Brother, you don't so challenge fast. Bobby and Capoeira. You're going to get fucking worked. Yeah. No, it's my fucking yeah, fault. Well, I got to tell you, we learned a lot today and I'm happy that you're white. Thank you. It changes my whole perspective on our friendship. And I love being here. Thanks for, thanks for having me. What can I get? If I'm a part of the club now, what do I get? I'll drink some more pumpkin spice yeah. latte. Oh, oh yeah. Do get, I get it like a Lakeview house? You get anything you want, baby. I can get in the Lakeview house? <laughs> you'll be up I'm the, white now. You'll be near the lake. You won't be on right. the lake. Can I go to the country clubs? You can, you can come to the dinner functions. Work there, you mean? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like pour water? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for being white. Thank you for being a bad friend. 